Today I will show you how to use Phoenix FD to set up a fire from a gas burner and use V-Ray Crypto Mod that gives us the possibility to modify the hue, saturation of the fire to imitate a proper gas burner as you can see on the image. So uh, here I have a gas hob. Let's have a texture applied on it. Pretty straightforward. Then I would like to single out and detach the main portion that you will assign the fire simulation. Check your unit setup so that uh, they, are, they are the same as mine in order to get the same results. I use millimeters. We will also adjust our time configuration to create a sequence, which in my case I'm using 0 to 60. The rest leave as default. Now we can add the fire simulation. Let's go to grid. This is where we do the resize, uh, affecting the X, Y, and Z axis. Under dynamics, change the, or rather let's beef up the quality to from 50 to 70. The rest leave as default. Go to output, change the backup interval to, to zero. Now, uh, putting into consideration our previous image and uh, knowing well the color of the flame from a proper gas burner, we will need to tweak a bit the hue or saturation. And uh, Vira Cryptomat will help us achieve this. And uh, render elements add Cryptomat. Uh, 
one thing I need to point out is a uh, crypto mat is available only using the bucket image sampler type so ensure to configure that accurately begin interactive rendering Add new layer of hue, saturation, and click on the button at the right corner. Click on Cryptomat. And using the pick tool, uh, click on the file. Then uh, moving to properties, adjust the, the hue until you arrive at the proper color for the flame. So uh, in today's video, we've learned how to use uh, Phoenix FD to set up a fire from a gas burner and use a uh, cryptomat that gives us the possibility to modify the hue, saturation of the fire to imitate a proper uh, flame coming from a gas burner. As always, please thumbs up the video subscribe and let me know in the comments section if you have any questions or suggestions or which areas you need clarification on